So you're needing some custom Twitch panels for your stream, but you're not a graphic designer and you really don't know how to use Photoshop or maybe you don't even have Photoshop. Well guys, don't worry. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you exactly how to make custom Twitch panels without Photoshop for your Twitch stream and we're going to get your stream looking awesome. Now guys, before we jump into making some custom Twitch panels, I want to remind you I am a streamer on Twitch at twitch.tv slash eaglegarrett. You can find me over there all the time, so come swing by and hang out with us in the stream. We would love to have you in the community. But with that, it is time to jump in and make some custom Twitch panels together, so let's do this. Now guys, as you can see, we are on my Twitch profile, and if we scroll down, you'll see all of my panels. Now, I am a graphic designer, so I did these in Photoshop because I had the time, but I'll tell you this, it takes a lot of time to make Twitch panels. Even if you're a designer and you know how to use Photoshop, this just takes some time, right? There's there's design elements that go in there and you've got to adjust things and sometimes we just don't have the time or maybe we don't have the, the know-how in Photoshop to be able to do this, but these are extremely important. You want your Twitch stream to have panels because this is where all the information about you goes. This is where people can support your stream through donations. They can subscribe, read your, your rules and guidelines. I mean, everything, even your schedule goes down here. So you want to have Twitch panels, but if you're not a designer, you don't have Photoshop, how are we going to do it? Well, I'm going to show you two ways to do it today. One of them is free and one of them costs less than $15. So it's a very, very cheap way to do it. And you can get all your Twitch panels done customized for less than 15 bucks. So let's start out with the free one, guys. And the first way to do it is going over here to Nerd or Die. All right. And the first place that I'm going to show you guys is Nerd or Die. Nerdordie.com is a place where you can actually make free Twitch panels. And part of the reason why we're not sponsored by Nerd or Die or anything like that, but because they have an online free Twitch panel creator, I figured I would show you guys in case you're looking for a free option. And if you come down here, actually look over here to the right side, you'll see all of these panels were made for free using their profile panel maker. And so they've got an awesome resource down here. And uh, you can see they've already got one set up as an example, but you can go through here and literally customize the way that this looks by changing things over here. So if I want this to be donations, I can say donations right there. Uh, let's give it a capital. There we go. Donations. I can come down here to the icon and open that icon picker. Let's change it to some money. There we go. Maybe want that a little bit smaller. Adjust that. There we go. Uh, you could do all kinds of cool stuff on here because you can even go in and change your font if you want. Okay. Then we're going to bring the font size down a little bit. It says donations. So we now have a uh, literally a donations panel that's already made. And if we want to customize it even further, we can go to effects. We can like enable or disable that little shadow that pops up right there on the money. We can uh, change the border width if we want it to be a little bit smaller. Uh, the border radius, we can actually round off those edges if we want to have a rounded rounded edge uh, type of panel, you know. The shadow, we can even change the, the angle of the shadow if we want to. So this is a really cool way to make custom panels for your Twitch stream. Um, you can even adjust the colors if you want. Like if we want this to be red because we really like red. We could always go in here and make that red or, or whatever you wanted to do. This is a great way to make panels. And once you're done, you can literally um, save the, the panel image by clicking this button and download the panel right to your computer. Um, and there's all kinds of different things. In fact, if you look up here, you can kind of get some inspiration for what they did. Um, you know, in fact, you can even like in here, it shows us that if we go to effects, we can we can, uh, or actually go to general, we can even change like the alignment if we want the, the image to be on the right side or the left side. I mean, all kinds of cool stuff, guys. So nerdordie.com, I'll put a link for this in the description of this video, this and everything else we talk about. Now, if you're looking for some quick, easy, and free Twitch panels, nerdordie.com is a great option because of how simple it is and the fact that it doesn't cost any money. But let's say that you're looking for something a little bit more customized with a few more design elements to them. Well, for less than $15, I'm going to show you an option that will allow you to do that. We're going to jump over to placeit.net, which is a sponsor here on this, this YouTube channel and on my Twitch stream, but is also a great place to come for designs, overlays, graphics, logos, Twitch panels, and anything else that you can imagine. So we're going to come over here to the website, and if we look up here at the gaming section, we hover over that, and then we go down to Twitch panels and click on it, it's going to bring us up a whole bunch of different options. Um, down here to get us started now you may be saying well if this is all they have that's not really a lot right but all of these are customizable so it's not just these options if i hover over one look at that it's going to give me different color schemes that i can choose from or that are ideas but then you can go in here and further 
customize these even more than they are. So let's say we click on this uh, Twitch panel template for cool games, right? Or cool gamers. We're gonna click on that one. And now, not only, let's say we wanna make this like a donation button. Not only can we, we can customize this logo over here. So I'm gonna go over here and say uh, donation, right? We're gonna use, I kinda like this, uh, this money logo here. So let's use that one. I guess we could also type in money. Yeah, there's even more options if you just type in money. But actually, you know what? I kind of want to use this piggy bank right here. So we're going to use the piggy bank, okay? We're going to change the accent color of the piggy bank to uh, green. Let's go ahead and change it to green. And then we want to make the piggy bank itself more of a kind of a, a, a peach color, right? For a little a little piggy, right? In fact, let's make that, um, let's make it a little darker. Yeah, we'll do something like that. Okay, so we have a piggy bank right over here. We can reposition this wherever we want, right? And it'll even give us guidelines. See that little guideline? So I know it's centered right there. And then let's say that I, I, I don't necessarily like this layout right here. You can actually go over here to the right side and you can customize the, the top and the bottom of this panel. So at the very top of the panel, let's say that I kind of want, let's say I kind of want these little dots, right? Or maybe even, uh, let's see what else we have. I kind of like this. This is kind of cool. I'm kind of liking this right here. So we're going to go with a simplistic thing at the top. And then at the bottom, let's go with something a little bit more designed. Okay. And then we're going to do for our colors, we're going to do a, a red. We're going to do a red right here for the top and the bottom. And then for the background color, we want to do, we're going to do a black for the background color. But then I want to go over here and change my text to white. Okay. Because we like, we like uh, the color scheme black and white. So there we go. Uh, this middle bar right here, we're probably going to need to change that to, uh, yeah, line color to uh, white. There we go. Okay, so now we have a red and black. We've got a red and black themed Twitch panel. We've got a little piggy bank over here for our donations. We can change the text from about me to donations. And down here, uh, support the stream. There we go. So we've got to support the stream donations right there set up ready to rock and roll guys. And you can do this for all of your panels. So once you find a design that you like, if you want all of your panels to look the same, then you can literally download each panel individually. And then every time you download one, you can just go in and change the text, change the logo, and you can have all your panels looking the same. Another thing you can do is if you want each panel to have a slightly different design element, then you can download one and then you can change the text and the, the logo and then just change your design elements at the top or the bottom for your next whatever the panel may be. And the great thing about it is this is extremely cheap to do, you guys. Uh, each one of these panels by itself costs $2.95, which you can see right up here. But because Placeit is one of our sponsors, we have a 15% discount that I can offer to you guys through the link in the description of this video. And you can actually go up here to the pricing. And if you click on pricing, not only could you buy each panel individually, but you could save a lot of money by just getting a monthly or an annual subscription. And with our discount in the, in the description of this video, through that link, you get 15% off of the monthly or the annual subscription. And so for instance, let's say you're like, okay, well, I only need Twitch panels. I don't need anything else. I just want to, you know, do this one time. Then come in here and get a monthly subscription, normal price, $14.95. If you use our discount, then it's actually like $12.70. And you can download as much stuff as you want from place at the entire website but that also includes Twitch panels. So you can download, you know, 10 Twitch panels if you want to. And it's, instead of spending $3 per Twitch panel, it's only gonna cost you that one time uh, charge of $12.70. Now, if you're on Placeit and you're like, hey, I feel like I'm gonna use Placeit for my Twitch panels. I'm probably gonna use it for some logos, maybe some, some animations maybe some YouTube stuff, then I would suggest going to the pricing and just getting yourself this $99.95 annual subscription with 15% off, which comes down to $85, you guys. In fact, if I go ahead and put on my, my um, let me go and put on my discount really quick. Okay, with my discount, guys, with a 15% discount, $12.70 for the monthly or $84.95 for the entire year, which is like $7.08 a month. Super cheap, and you can download anything on places that you want. Unlimited for that one-time charge for either the month or the year. But guys, Placeit is awesome. This is my recommendation for custom Twitch panels because it's just so easy, it's so simple. You don't have to have any Photoshop design experience whatsoever, and you can make yourself custom panels that look fantastic, and it's so cheap that, I mean, why not? It's much, much cheaper to do it this way than it is to hire a designer. Designers can do a great job, and they can be even more customized, but 
unless you're to the point where you want to spend, you know, a few hundred dollars potentially on Twitch designs, um, why not use Place It and do it that way, guys? So this is my recommendation. I love Place It and I highly recommend it. But guys, there you have it. Nice, easy, simple ways to make Twitch panels right here on the internet without Photoshop. I hope it's been a help to you guys. And of course, all the links are in the description of this video. So if you want that 15% discount for Place It, um, or you need any of the other information like the Nerd or Die link to that panel maker, it's all down there. Check it out, guys. I hope this has been helpful to you. If you do wind up using Place It to make some Twitch panels, come let me know in my stream at twitch.tv slash eaglegarrett. I would love to come by and check out what you did with the Place It panel maker. Don't forget guys, if you like this video, smack that like button to help get this video out to as many people as possible. And of course, if you like this channel, smack that subscribe button. And don't forget to smack that notification bell to know when videos go live. Also, you can find me on Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, and all the socials. So come check me out on there. I would love to have you guys. Links for everything we talked about in the description, including that 15% off link for Place It. Guys, I appreciate you. Remember, rock on, peace out, God bless. And last but not least, so you can't you can you can you hold more ammo like overall or you can only have 15 rounds with it oh yeah if you get the fully loaded first yeah okay cool 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 okay, i gotta get into position to snipe though because oh, here we go dude i just saved our he was getting assassinated bro and i just sniped the guy off of him and he lived Let's go. bro somebody clipped that i just saved that man's life <laughs> oh my gosh dude